What's up guys and welcome to Factorio. As you can see here, I think my iron level line, it's not uh, its not full enough. I mean look, this guy here at the end, he's not getting any iron. That's just uh, one of the first symptoms. When I start adding more stuff on the end here, it's going to be a problem. There's not enough iron coming through. So what I think I'm going to do is upgrade some of these little furnaces to, um, whatchamacallit, electric furnaces. And I got new science. Let's do some big long uh, thing. How about this inserters? Two hundred of everything. It's going to take a nice long time. It's not going to not going to bother me for a while. All right. So electric furnaces. I need advanced circuits, which I can make. Uh, I have them laying around somewhere, and I need stone bricks. Well then, stone bricks. Let's see. Look at that stone bricks. Don't I have a little stone brick factory somewhere? Let's take a look. Somewhere off to the side, I had a little. Uh, there, right, right up here. All right, um, and quite a bit of stone bricks. So I think we'll be okay. It's not um, powered at the moment. I could replace this with a, uh, a steel furnace. Let's just do that. And because we got electricity coming here anyway, so blink. That way, why this? Oh, it still needs fuel. Well, you know what? I should put an electric furnace here then. Let's make an electric furnace. And it's... Hold on, hold on, stop. I should grab a bunch of red circuits, otherwise it's going to make them all manually in my inventory. And I don't want to do that. So let's take a look. Where are my red circuits at? Way over here. Okay, so if I pick them up, I'm going to pick up a bunch of smart inserters at the same time. Which I could probably live with. That's 20. Let's make... A furnace and I need to get rid of this guy otherwise it's gonna stick in my inventory for a long time and you know suddenly I also I don't want to put the uh, electric furnace there where it's making stone bricks because really I don't need that many stone bricks ever so what I could do is put a little box of coal that feeds into there now let's just let's just leave it running. It's fine. It has a nice bit of fuel in there now. It's fine. I've got my first electric furnace. And if you remember from the very first or second episode, I can't remember what it was. I don't. Yeah. Uh, the way I did this layout allows me to, you know, increase the size of the furnaces here. So let's get rid of everything here and put in our first electric furnace like this put a chest back here with two fast guys there we go it doesn't need fuel so it doesn't need this red inserter here so yeah that's basically it I can make uh, two more let's do that it's gonna take some time we'll get rid of this second row of guys here I might need to Replace a little bit of power lines because they need to they need to sit right on top of each other. These electric furnaces. So here's another one. Let's get the blue guy in it. Blue guy out out with a chest in the middle. I put a steel chest. That's fine. It was iron chest before. I need to replace it all with bigger power lines. So probably big power line. Here and here. So let's get rid of this small one. Yeah, that's going to be the basic layout. And it should speed up my production. So at some point I probably have to boost up the um, the collection of crap here too. Because I, I just I destroyed two furnaces. But it, during that time, uh, before that, the, the ore wasn't really reaching the end of it here. Alright, let's, uh, let's put another one in. Ding, ding, ding. Oh crap, I didn't mean to do that. Come back. Also interesting, now everything's putting on putting on the uh, the opposite of the track because it's uh, a little bit closer. So into the furnace. And like this, onto the track. I probably have a lot of this stuff. Put that in here. Yeah, electric furnaces. Pretty cool. I need to probably do that all the way through here. Power is still okay. 
Let's see what I need for a couple more electric furnaces. I need a lot of steel, which is up here in this chest. A lot of steel. What else do I need? I need a lot of advanced circuits. I only have five in my inventory right now, so let's grab a couple more. Maybe I should make the... No, I just, I'll just do this again. I even grabbed some batteries. Okay, I can make three more. One, two, three. And, um... Yeah, bit by bit, that's how we upgrade it. And then we'll look at where are the next places where we have a shortage, which might be the ore. We might need to, you know, speed up some more of this belt. Some places, maybe have one of those jump to the other end kind of guys. Kind of like, um... Kind of like what this is doing. It's putting it from, you know, putting it on both sides of the track. Where's an example of what I'm talking about? I think probably with the ore. No. I, I don't remember where I have an example of what I'm talking about. Basically where everything is on one side of the track and I'm like, hey, half you, come to this, this side of the track. Oh, right here, right here, with the circuits. So everything is on one side, but I'm like, hey, split up and come join on this other other side, because then, you know, more fun times. Wait, wait, wait. I'm putting three new guys down, so that's one. Damn it, I thought I'd have a long time to uh, insert. I can't. I don't have the aliens yet. That's one thing I need to do in the future. Aliens, lasers, electric engines. Let's do. You know, we're we're. Which one has me like robotics and flight? This robotics. Let's do this one. I want to start making uh, flying robots that do my bidding pretty soon. That will be that'll be pretty fun for the next episode, maybe. All right, and the last one. And I'll probably get rid of the power lines here and here. I think that hasn't destroyed any power. All right, we'll put in my three furnaces, put in the inserters, outserters. I know that's not what they're called, but they're like inserters, inserters on the exit side. That's why I feel like they're outserters and big poles. So if I get rid of this line, everything is destroyed there. Now everything has power again. Here and here, get rid of this pole. There we go. I hope that it ruined anything. Accidentally having like no power for a little bit. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Everything's fine. All right, that's starting to look some look pretty good. Let's put a, a little bit of lights in there. I need iron plates. Where do I have a nice iron plate stockage? Right here. Bet that in my inventory. Let's make like ten lights. What's all in here? A turret, stone furnace, and a bunch of wood. I have a blue science pack for some reason. Let's go put that in somewhere. And put it right in here. Point. Now it looks like I don't have enough green science. That is weird. The ingredients are all enough. I wonder, maybe, you know, I do have space here to add another assembly machine or two. Let's start with one. Let's first, let's first put up some big power poles. Where, where am I, uh, the power poles I like? These are, these are too big. Need some more of these. All right, let's put this one here and here, and we can probably get rid of some poles. Hold on a second before I before I delete them. Let's put this one here, here. All right, we can get rid of this one in the middle. And we'll put in our first extra dude. We'll do one at a time. All right, insert and out and make green for me. There we go. That should increase the production of green. Now red, on the other hand, red, there's still a nice fat queue of it, but I feel like, see what I did is I added two more science things on the end here before recording. 
so we can probably do with one more red science generator. And then we'll find out that the blue is not enough and we have to make another blue science generator. You know what, we'll just leave it like this for now. What were we up to? What were we up to? Oh yeah, we're just monitoring that. We're going to put some lights in here. That That's what I was going to do. There we go. A light bulb. There we go. Starting to look good. Starting to look very nice. And the research is going so fast. Look at that. It's almost done already. Advanced Electronics 2. Allow me to build some pretty cool stuff, I think. Anyway, we're getting iron plates down here, which is good. I think the reason why it started building so much so quickly because I, I took out a bunch of circuits from here. Take some out of this chest. Look, and all suddenly, all of a sudden, this thing kicks into production. A lot of iron goes in here. Copper. We're not getting enough copper in here. And we got another research. Yay. Let's do the electric engine. Uh, yeah, electric engine. Let's see, well, can we build any... Uh, where Where is it on the tap? Radar. We don't need radar. I got the heavy armor. I put that on. I don't remember where you can build little drones. Is that later as well? Engine unit. Gonna have to build some of those soon. And then electric engine units. It's, it's gonna need... I'm gonna need a lot of, a lot of confusing stuff pretty soon. Anyway, what I'll probably do is um, increase increase the supply here of uh, of copper. So we'll have two more miners. Where are the miners? Here. One, two. This one will go here, and then we'll put another one right. You know right here. There'll be a lot on one side of the track, but I think that's not an issue. That shouldn't be an issue. He doesn't have power and he doesn't have conveyor belts. Let's just use the old old power lines. I still have some of those. There we go. That should get more copper ore into there. Maybe at some point I want uh, fast inserters here too, but nah, that's not going to be necessary just yet. Um... Oh yeah, okay, I'm just wondering, how the hell is this iron and copper going up there? But that's because here I decided to split it off. Nice, everything is going fast. Look at this, flight. This is what I need for construction and logistic robotic, robotics. But that is something I'm going to leave for the next episode. In the meantime, I will uh, you know, g give a minute for my sponsor. Yeah, I don't have a sponsor. All right. Well, thanks guys very much for watching. I will uh, continue upgrading the rest of these to electric furnaces, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.